All right, so we're starting out with a Gelos. Now, this is very, very, very NES style. This is a game from P-Cube, who seemed pretty cool. They have a very, they have a very robust catalog of games. I think they're a publisher as well as a developer. Uh, they seem to have a very good library from the looks of it, of things. I'm, I'm intrigued by it. Now, do let me know, guys, if the game audio is too loud or whatever. This seems like a bit of a loud game, but I, I actually probably let those just down a little bit. Let me know if it's too loud, but it should be fine. Let's let us start. Let us start our adventure. That does. Oh yeah, that's right. Let me disable Joy to Key because it's causing issues. There we go. <laughs> Sorry, Joy to Key was being weird. Adventure. Yes, new game, please. Uh, let's see. Uh, I hate myself. Let's go. No let's go hard. It looked like an ordinary day, except for the world was in darkness. But something was drawing you towards the western woods. As if your destiny was awaiting you there. Oh, this is very old school. I like this. Okay. Nice! Alright. I'm down for this. What do we got? I cut grass like Zelda. Just checking. This all. Oh, shit. Okay, so there's a currency system. So this is kind of doing a Zelda 2 thing, I guess? Sort of? Actually, what's the best exa What's the best NES example for a side scroller slashy game with experience? And that is pretty Zelda 2, actually. Oh, God, this is so Zelda 2. What does it say? You found an herb. It will heal you automatically if you lose all your HP. Nice. Oh, this is great. This is- I already like this. This controls really well, by the way. This is already wonderful. Monster Boy! Yeah, Wonder Boy. It is kind of like Wonder Boy. Help! I mean, if you ask, if you ask politely, I will. Oh no, a damsel in distress, a, a sidestepping kobold guy. Save me, please. Give me the girl. I have nothing against you. You're refusing. In that case, prepare to die. Oh, okay. Gotcha. I'm fine. Thank you so much. I am Princess Liss of Lumen. Why are you just running around outside, then? Valiant kid kidnapped me some time ago. I managed to escape, but the kingdom is in danger. We must visit the king. What? I have to take shelter in your house? Well, very well, if you think it's too dangerous for me. You will meet the king and send me an es escort. But you should know that the castle is not accessible through the main entrance. The kind of a shitty castle, then. You have to go through a secret passage. What? I mean, maybe it's blockaded right now. I don't know. How's the volume, by the way? Is it, is it all good? There's a cave in the forest to the west of the castle. The passage is there. We must hurry. Be careful. Well, I must hurry. You're gonna go sit at the house. Don't eat all my Kit Kats! I've been stockpiling them. Gosh. It's a save point. I like saving. Yeah, this is great. What's this? I don't know. Fuck flowers. Oh, it's a bear! He looks friendly. I'm gonna slash him repeatedly. Oh, that's the flowers are evil. So far, I know hit run. By the way, it's probably gonna change as soon as I say that. Um, <clears throat> is this dangerous? No. Oh god, I'm underwater. Can I breathe underwater? I see him okay. Oh, friendly fish! Let me kill them. If I start drowning, it's not my fault. Oh no, I got hit! Oh well. Oh. The song has a second part. Interesting. Oh, thanks for the heart. There's nothing here. But I'll take the juicy experience. And money. 
Why do you have to kill the cute things? Because experience. <laughs> because experience, man. All right, cool. I'm on my way. Got an achievement. The song is a lot longer than I originally anticipated. There's a chest up there. I bet I can get that by drowning myself in the right place. Would you kill a dog first? I might avoid doggo. Also, I'm going to... Hold on a second. So that guy gives three. That guy gives what? One? Yeah, it's not worth it. It's not worth grinding. I could grind. But it's probably not it, worth it. That means you're a speciest. Oh. Oh, they're not friendly after all, see? Ow. I just want all the money, really. They look so proud of themselves, like, look, I jumped out of the water! Wow! Oh god, it's like cheap cheeps. Oh my god. Money! I want to get all the money so I can buy great things. Yeah, so I'm gonna just say this right now. This is already I can already say I'm gonna I'm gonna be uh, proving this game. Though, so, does anybody here want to do me a little favor and look up Agelos? That is A G G E L O S on Steam. L let me know what the price is because I usually do not know these things before I play them. Tuluman Castle. Fish hugs? I mean, I'm okay with fish hugs. They'd be a little slimy, but... That herb? Oh, that's an herb. It will heal me if I die. Ooh. New music. Oh, this flower has the advantage on me. Oh, I can destroy the pollen. Okay. That makes life easier. I can just slash pollen into... 1499. That is a little bit... That's a little bit pricey, but... This, this game definitely exudes quality, let me just tell you. I can tell with that spider. I love it when I can tell what an enemy's gonna do before I actually have fought it. Like, I knew that spider was gonna drop on me. Bosco Village. Hello. Are you Bosco? Check your map in the menu to find your way. Do I have a map? <gasps> Look at this map. Bosco, Fira, Celestia, Atlant. I like these names. All right, this seems like a fairly lengthy game then, I would, I would guess. What kind of equipment do I have? A sword and I have armor. Oh, well, pretty standard. Inventory. Okay, so there's elements. There's, yeah, there's this is there's game here. There's This is not going to be super short, I think. So, I mean, $15? It seems pretty... It's it's very good quality. Try to always have a curative herb on you. Come back if you don't have any left. Are you just going to give me free ones? It's nice. Let's let's keep playing. Well, I can, I can judge for sure if it's worth $15. But so far, I'd say yes. This feels like you'd just be buying a retro game at a... At a, at a, you know, at, at a fucking... I don't know what place to sell you retro... It's mostly just small game comic shops to sell retro games. But, like, if you just pick up a retro game for $15, $15, and it's a good retro game, I think that's reasonable, right? So, in that case, I think this price is reasonable, too. I can buy potions. Oh, my. That's very expensive. Nah, I'm good. Add an herb. There's a monkey up there. The monkeys are not bad, but they cannot prevent themselves from stealing. Even things that are useless to them. Oh, so they got an addiction? That's too bad. Hello, addic addicted monkey. Ah, per percentage number, 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 key, number, number, percentage, percentage, number. I understand. Hey! He actually did still for me. <laughs> he took some of my money! <laughs> no, he didn't take much. It's fine. He can have it. When you're on a platform, press down, jump to go down. You can also press down, jump before landing to go faster. Really? Oh yeah, look at that. It may I may learn the love monkey language and then I can do monkey things. All right, what we got here? Steel sword, gimme. What's this? Steel armor, gimme. Yes, I will definitely equip them. That sounds like an idea. Oh wow, that's like almost double. 
Not quite, but getting there. Oh, look, the sword changes and the armor changes. Nice. I like that addition to detail. Uh, okay, so I can go to the Bosco Cave down there and go to... Alright, what's, what's going up to? I don't know what that's gonna do, but I'm assuming pollen everywhere. Oh. Oh, he's got, like, like, a lot of experience. Snake, what are you doing, Snake? Snake! Snake, come on now. Don't break the rules of reality, it's not allowed. You must die for this. Basically an NES game without sprite flickering. Which makes it- oh no, it's like- oh god, it's like P-Hats from Zelda, shit! You guys remember the P-Hats from Ocarina? They- they sucked. Monkey! Don't do it! If you walk away from- if you turn their back- your back on them and walk away, they'll steal from you. The pink monkey. I definitely will learn their language, though. It's pretty obvious with that guy. It's pretty obvious with that guy being there. Ow. Or girl? I guess it's pink monkey, so probably girl. That's how this works at NES games, right? So how much experience am I getting in this area? I need to pay more attention. Five from them, that's pretty good. Seven from them, okay. Snake, you're doing it again, come on now. Oh god. Two from them, okay. Oh my, that's slime. I don't know how I feel about- Oh god, okay! <laughs> Oh, I bet I, I bet I need links. I bet I need the the sword downward bounce that, from Zelda Two for that. Or maybe I just need to fall from a high height. Let's see if I'm right. Yeah, I can. Yeah, that's what I need. I need a downward stab. That is obvious because I can break it with my sword. So. You want, me, you want to see me get bored? I bet it would just do damage, but we'll, we could see. Ow. Oh, Arctator. Nice. Yeah, this is definitely pulling... I think you, you're right about Wonder Boy, because the animation... Like, the character animation actually reminds a lot of Wonder Boy, but I do believe there's a lot of Zelda 2 inspiration here as well. Anyways, here, let's see. Yeah, it just does damage. That being said... Pretty good experience on him. That was a lot of damage, yes. I'm just gonna farm this thing until it gives me enough hearts to continue safely. Or until it levels me, one or the other. I think that will restore my hearts, so. I also could go back and save, I think that heals you, but... It's fine. I'm glad I chose hard mode, though. I think that it feels like the... I feel like even this hard mode... This, this doesn't... This doesn't feel Nintendo hard, even on hard mode, which is fine. There's nothing wrong with that. Nintendo hard is... Essentially a little bit bullshit, so. But I feel like the damage I'm taking is reasonable. The controls are very fluid, so if I get hit, it's my own fault. Hearts drop pretty rarely, though. I bet on uh, normal they drop more often. But that's fair. Again, I don't see any problem with that. Hard might show when I reach a boss, this is true. I'm rich now, though, by the way. 
slime is the slime has done me well. I guess he's not gonna be giving me. A, I guess he's not gonna give me another heart before I level. That's fine. I'll just get a level. I like. I like. I don't mind doing a little bit of grinding. If it is hard mode, I may as well. Hi. Okay. He wasn't paying much attention that time. Like, one game I cannot play, Shinobi. The Shinobi games on NES, I can't play them. They're just... They're just a little too ridiculous. I also am going to check something. Yeah, my yeah, I went, my attack went up too. So yeah, when you level, you do get stronger stats. I wasn't sure, but indeed that is how that works. And now we know. Door. Snake, you have the high ground. No, you don't. Ha! Ah. No. By the way, remember how last Howler I was, uh... You remember how last hour we played that game where money bounced everywhere out of every enemy and object, and I was getting really annoyed about how everything bounced around? Well, I was... This is how... This game is doing it right. The game... The money still bounces around, but if I'm clever, I can easily... Oh, well, that fell away, but that's fine. I can easily collect it, though. It's, this is fine. What are these, like... Electric fireflies that he avoid, or yes, can't seem to hurt them either. All right, yeah, this is a good. This is a good. Uh, si this is a good comparison to the last, to, la to that other game. Like in the sense of, here's how you do it right. You know, oh, it's a mole. It's a mole guy. Hi, mole guy. I am combat instructor mole. Take this, young warrior. I, I combat instructor mole is the best mole. You got the mole scroll. That rhymes. Press down and attack to throw a downward attack. It is literally yep. It's Zelda 2's uh, downward attack, except for it looks cooler. I like I like how the legs spread out for that. Tubby. Wonder Boy. This is not Wonder Boy, but it's it's a Gellos, and it's really good. I have to say, this is really good. I, I, I $15 might be a little bit high, typically, for a pixel-based game, but I think I, I think in this case I can excuse it. This is, this exudes quality. Honestly, though, just because a game looks nostalgic, that shouldn't mean that it should be charged less for. It all depends on the quality. But I have run into a lot of pixel-based games that are kind of lazily made. Where basically the fact it was pixely was kind of a excuse to draw simpler graphics to exude less effort. This game is not doing that though. This game has really nice pixel art that feels like it supports the game not and it's not an attempt at being lazy. There are good retro style games. It's just you have to, it's just effort. It's all about the effort. Hi mouse. Oh god, it's a mouse. <laughs> I wasn't gonna fight it, but then it ran at me, so I had to hit it. You know this song? This song makes me... You know what this song makes me think of? It makes me think of, I think, the caves from uh, The Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening on Game Boy. It makes me think of some Link's Awakening music. I love it. It's good. I'm gonna check walls. I feel like I might find secrets. Yeah, this controls really well, by the way. Hmm, upper left, or upper, up, upper right, I should say. Which left? This left. Okay. 
Not that way. This way. There's a strange crack. There is indeed a strange crack. Alright. That seems to go somewhere. Uh, what about... How many paths are there? There's also this way. Alright. Oh, this is that end. I'll go here first. Oh, free potion. Why well, I have to make every enemy super cute because they're good pixel artists. Oh, the slime hearts are sh latex sh shadow shadow hearts now. Yes, I decided to upgrade the purple, mostly to replace the existing Twitch purple heart because it's not as good as that. I have now upgraded it. Door is locked. So I found two locked doors so far. Actually, one moment. I need to check something. Oh, cool! All the emotes got approved. Cool, that was pretty fast. So we all have, we have, the new emotes are all in line. Oh, wait, no, that's not true. The smug's not there yet. Okay, well, you guys will have to wait patiently for smug to show up. Sorry about that. Can we, can we still have a white heart or are they just going to be purple now? If you guys really want a white heart, I'll put it as a sub two. I'll put it at the sub two or sub three level. Oh, wait, no. Oh, is smug still there? Oh, that's good. I thought it was gone for some reason. It's not, you know what's weird? It's not there for me. I don't have it for some reason. That's weird. Well, anyways, let's go over here. Oh, what the? The hell are you? I look very happy to be you, though, I guess. Oh man, these look like Monster Boy enemies. They're like monkey demons. That's a pretty good experience. I wanted something a little more appropriate for the uh, server. That's why I changed it to purple. Look, guys, when I hit partner, don't worry. I'll, I'll we'll have a we'll have even more uh, slots for, for tier one emotes, so I can add in white heart again when we get partner. Okay, that's my plan. Now, as of net right now. What's that, young fellow? What did you say? The prince is hiding your house. Very well. We'll send an escort to bring her back. Then I will take you to see the king. He seems very chill about this. King Gentle, you protected my daughter. I'm eternally grateful to you. Liz, you told me what the, the situation is serious. What is happening? When I was captive, Valiant said that he finally had all four elements in his possession and that destruction was upon us. I couldn't really understand what he meant about elements. But he's probably planning another attack. So that's what it was. Not long ago, Valiant abducted my daughter and wanted me to hand him the key of the kingdom, or he would hurt her. Oh no, it's not good. I gave in. He wanted the key to gain access to the Earth Temple. As Liz said, he now has all four elements. But what is he planning to do with those? Seer, I understand now, it's a tragedy. See, there are four elements in nature. Earth, water, fire, and air. These elements are the base of our world, the world of light. Light is the ultimate element. Each of these elements ha have their opposite, but th there's the world of light, but it's also the world of darkness. Okay, much like, uh... Okay, we're going to go into a Link to the Past territory. With these elements, he can tr transcend frontiers and open breaches between the two worlds. Are you thinking about that thing beneath, this thing beneath the castle? Exactly. For now, it's only a breach, but it'll soon be a door, and there'll be more... What will happen when the doors open? I don't know. And this world is built on harmony and balance, and the other world is disorder and chaos. He surely plans something disastrous. In that case, we must attack! His army is weak, but so is yours. You'll never get him. The portal's opening is inevitable and imminent. The only solution is to collect all four elements and prepare for an attack from the other world. We'll send troops to collect the elements. This is useless. We can't assimilate the elements' essence. It's only special beings can. Who will do it, then? Him! Liz, what? Jing Jindal and Liz, what? The gods gave me a vision not long ago. He's the one I saw. I don't know why or how, but he, like Valiant, can assimilate the elements' essence. You already did a lot by saving my daughter. You're a great warrior and our only chance. Will you embark on this quest to save us? Of course. It's a video game. I knew you would. Here, take this. It's a new sword. It's a kingdom of the kingdom. Okay. I can open locked doors. 
The same that was given to Valiant. You should go to the chest room. I have to go back to my quarters. If you ever feel lost, come to me. I'll use my powers to guide you. Okay. His army is weak, but so... Sears is fucking, like, just hardcore about this, like... <laughs> He's a th kind of a thug about it. <laughs> I believe in you. We would have liked to do more, but we have to protect the castle. If the castle falls, will be the end of Lumen. Yeah, I love it. We're all ready to die for the kingdom. The princess once had a pendant she cherished. One day, in the guards, a monkey stole it from her. I, it, happened, it happened under my watch, and I'm deeply ashamed of it. But she never blamed me. Knowing her, she probably never told you about it. Go to the chest room if you haven't already. So I need to learn monkey language so I can, uh... I don't know. Get... Get that pendant back? Hello, are you an alchemist? You are! I'm the alchemist! Come back to me after you possess all four elements. I'll synthesize the light essence. That sounds like fun. Can you give me a potion, turn me into a kobold or something in the meantime? Come on. This is like Wonder Boy. I should turn into things. My gifts are limited without my crystal ball. If I had it, you'd, I could know why you were able to assimilate the elements. I can still use my powers to guide you. Sure. Guide me. With your lack of a crystal ball. I see a door in the cave underneath the forest. Yep, I was gonna go check that anyway, so... In the meantime, I'll read a comic book. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. Hope you'll be up to the task. I would have liked to fight alongside you. It's this way. Oh, it leaves. Oh, so the main entrance was blocked for no apparent reason, because now it's just open. 33 minutes left. Yes. Having a good time, though. It's over here. Oh, yeah, that's right. I still want to know what this thing is. It's like some sort of eggplant mixed with a spiky mace and a... some sort of Muppet. <laughs> um, yeah, this is good. This game makes me smile, too. Everything about this just feels good. I I'm really enjoying this one. All right, let's open some doors. I like money. I already had one. I'll take it. Too bad I can't have more than one herb. By the way, who says herb and who says herb? Some people say herb. I'm pretty sure it is actually herb, but... Looks like a rattlesnake. It honestly... Oh, hello. Sorry, I attacked you. Italy died and escaped a pearl. Red escape with a random dark latex coven. Oh, you're talking about... <laughs> Chain CTS, right. That was big money. It was big money. That's just locked. And it goes into darkness, so we don't want to go there anyways, I guess? These mouse skitter around much like the mice from, uh... Or these mice skitter around much like the mice from, uh... Much like the mice from, uh, A Link to the Past, actually. If you remember the mice enemies from A Link to the Past, they... Have the they had really random movements where they kind of... Bounced around. Also, I appreciate my sword slash hits above me a little bit. That's nice. Hello. Oh, shit. Chris, you made me run into a mouse. Or possibly a rat. Probably a rat. I was reading your chat message, and then I ran into it. <laughs> so it's all your fault. Oh, God. That was not your fault, though. I just kind of did that. What are these fish doing? Trying to juke me or fake me out. It did say the key, key to the kingdom, you know. Yes, well, I'm... Wait, hold on. I need to know something. Something very important. Oh, they can be underwater. I thought I would just die. Good to know. Oh wait, no, I need to go down. Apparently in this world no one can drown. I guess not. It's good. Drowning's for... Drowning is such a drag anyways, so... Yeah, you know, it's good that... 
I couldn't jump for some reason. That was entirely my own failing. Here we go. What we got? Be careful, bright plants. Yes, I should be. Okay, I need to make sure. Oh, there's a lot of bright plants. Oh no, a little fire. Oh god, they're gonna attack. Okay. I'll just pass that. What the hell is this? It's something that wants to puke. Wow, that. Can I? Thanks. Wasn't sure if I could. <laughs> I wanted to be careful. These are some tricky jumps, actually. Well, kind of tricky. Die, weird slug puking thing. Hmm. The controls are really good, though, so I can actually dodge all this stuff. Yeah, the controls are so good, actually. I don't think those hurt you. I mean, maybe they do. Uh, they probably do. I think they do. Music is pretty cool, I agree. Back to the Bosco Forest, Earth Temple. Where's this exit? You've intersected with the sprites a couple- They did hurt me before. They did- I think- No, they did hurt me before, Essler. They're just- The sprite- the, the, the hitboxes are just really reasonable, like, really fair about it. That's all. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, we're back here, right, okay. So that loops around, got it. How long am I gonna stream for? Well I usually stream till about ten PM. You can actually see my schedule below this below the video. But I will note for anyone who is new or not aware, I will be taking a two week hiatus after uh, May ends, because I am moving internationally, so... A mental note, there's a path up there. Alright. Oh, I missed him. That's okay. Must be blind. It says it just says when I when you start not in. Well, n no, the the countdown says when I start, but there's also a thing that tells you when I. There's a different there's a different card. If you look if you look around, besides don't look at the countdown thing. There's another little. Uh, there's just a, there's just an image card down below my video that says my stream schedule. So many cards. I have a lot of cards. Oh god. Oh god. Stop. Top right, yeah. Though my countdown is all you really need to look at to know when I start. But 10 is usually when I stop. Yeah, I was like, I didn't want to wait. I'll just do the jump. What's this? Let's see. Top right. Oh god. Spiky guy. Stop the spiky guy. Right? No, I cannot delete the fireballs. Good enough. This definitely feels like a Zelda 2 dungeon too. I'm not actually a big fan of Zelda 2, but I like this game way more than it actually. Also, thank you for the follow. I think that was a follow. Hmm, I can't cross this. I'm pretty good at platformers, I think.
This is also kind of interesting. I like this. Interesting elevator. Oh, there it goes. Oh. Do, do I already have a key? I do not have a key, so I don't... Hmm. Okay. Did I, wait, maybe... Did I, oh, wait, hold on. I have a hunch. If, I, if I'm right, then I missed some stuff earlier. Did they give a lot of experience? Nope, I was wrong. I thought maybe if I bounced off those things, I could, like, move around, but... Nope. There's no way I can... There's no way I can clear that jump, either, so... Yeah, they, those, those chameleons... Spiky Chameleon guys definitely do give some good experience. See, I don't... Oh, shit. Whoops. Top blocks fall if you break the ones below them? I don't think so. I'm not... I'm actually kind of stuck? Well, let me go back. Let me go back. I'll figure it out. Oops. Oh wait, I know the- I'm stupid, guys. I know what's going on here. Oh. I would've- I could've sw I w I was gonna say there's probably a chest here. Nope. Also, what am I- f I'm sorry, what am I failing? I don't understand why you guys keep saying I'm failing. What exactly am I failing? Could you explain? Oh. I don't know why I had- I had in my head I needed to jump over that. Ow. Also, I'm gonna see something. Okay. Just wanted to see. Apparently I'm not that smart. <laughs> Like, are you not gonna attack? All right. <laughs> We're both dog smart. Yeah, that's the thing. When you have the ring's power, it hit an enemy to gain some magic points. I got found the I found the big chest in the Zelda dungeon. Earth ring's power. All right. Press up plus elemental key. Touch a wisp to turn it into a platform. Oh, okay. So now I can get through the Earth Temple. I knew those wisp pets. I, I those wisps are all over the place in such a way I knew something would happen. Hold the element key to create a platform when you kill an enemy. Okay, I understand. Thank you. How do I... I need to... Okay. Uh... Oh, I see. Oh, wrong place, but... Okay, I get it. Wow, I dodged the fireball too. Nice. Yep, kibble is a loyalty thing. And I have, I didn't, uh, I. Cuphead's Cup, Cuphead's art style kind of bothers me, but I'll play it if you want me to. Also, I'm pretty low on health. I just realized. 
All right, hold on. You actually you know what? Hold on, we're gonna leave. There's a save point outside the Earth Temple. I'm gonna go go over there. I don't like old timey cartoon styles. I don't like the constant movement. I don't like the eye style. It just bothers me. I can't really explain it. Was there not a save point around here? I thought there was. No, wait, no, it's down. It's down if I... Actually, where is it? It's down here, right? Oh, no, it isn't. I guess I should just keep advancing. There's really no save points around here. Let's be very careful. I think I can take one more hit, but after that, well... Oh! Oh! Also, hearts do drop from enemies, but not very often. Alright. I'm not gonna make the I almost made the same mistake again. Then I was like, wait, nope. Oh god, okay. That didn't work out. Gotta make sure I get them positioned just right. Kinda wish they had to move around, to be honest. No, 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 oh shit, 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 shit. Oh, I do have a oh, that's right, I had an herb, I forgot about that. I was like, that guy needs to die quickly, and then he backed up, so he got another attack off, great. Ah, uh, good thing for the herb, then. I guess I'll get another one later. Hmm. Okay. That looks like progress. I mean, you can still request Cuphead if you want. I'm, I'm sure it's play certainly fun to play. I just never liked old-timey cartoon styles. But it looks great. I mean, they did a fantastic job on it. They just did a fantastic job on an art style I don't like, that's all. In the woods. I have not played that. I had an ex friend that was really big into that. I never ended up playing it though. Look pretty nice though. Pretty chill. Oh. It's a vine skull? Okay. Alright. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on there. I guess I'm supposed to use magic and kill these things for more magic. Oh. oh. Shit. This is an interesting enemy. Oh. Ow. I don't have any herbs. Okay, thank god. They have nothing to hurt like a truck. That was a good boss. I like that animation was very good. This game's very. This game is sweet. Like this is this is a good game, very good game. So let's see where were where were Wisp and where can I? Come on then. I'm trying to remember where all the wisps I could use as platforms are. But I can also use enemies as platforms, that's worth noting. Alright, here's one place. Oh, 
Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, well. Uh, I guess I am the well. Here's the problem too. I need whatever. God damn it. Whatever I uh, whatever I am offered, I whatever I'm asked to play, I I need the game as well if I don't have it already. There we go. <laughs> too hasty, apparently. Oh bugger. Back. Okay. Same point. Yes. Thank you. Yes. I also I saw the slash blocks, but clearly I can't do anything about those. Kind of rich, aren't I? Let's see, were there any, uh... What is the other direction? Yeah, these things do hurt me, I'm just very good at... ...dodging them. See? They do hurt. They actually hurt a fair bit, too. Ow. Ow. Well, I'm getting really beat up all of a sudden. Hello, Twitch. Yeah, okay. So there's nothing down here. There's nothing else for me here. All right. I don't think there was wisps anywhere else, were there? That's all the wisps I've seen. But I can, of course, use enemies as platforms elsewhere too, which I might end up doing. Slime by for a few minutes? That's fair. I'm actually gonna go this way. I wanna check something. goes to the castle, right? Actually, wait, I don't remember. Hmm. I'm trying to find something. But yes. Okay, Hessler. Well, you enjoy that. Uh, I'll hope it goes well. Let me know how that's been going, actually. Wasn't there a chest I not here? Wasn't there a chest I could have get somewhere? Oh, what's that? Ah, oh, you have redeemed Nine in the Woods. Cool. Right, so uh, what I'm going to do... I could have sworn there was something I missed. Well, been there. First off... Yeah, this. Ow. Well, that guy hurts a lot. Is 
is probably where I'm supposed to go next, isn't it? Oh, this, that just killed it. All right. Lumen Castle and Lant Village. Yeah, this is the new. This is the next area. Right before I go here, though, there's there's something else I need to check. That isn't the dragonflies chasing me. That is not what I need to check. Joltik. Joltik. Sure. Oh, thanks for making life easy on me, buddy. How much is that thing worth? It gives a lot of money. Beerus? It's hard to find the right game. Oh, that's a good paw. That's actually a really good paw. I like that paw. I need a good paw like that, too. Like, I mean, I have a good foot, obviously, but I need, like, a nice paw pad focused paw. That would be good. Wouldn't you guys agree? I need a paw like that. I just want to confirm something at the very beginning of the game. Right, okay. Thought I, for some reason, thought there was a whisk to the left, to the right of the house, but I guess I was wrong. But yeah, guys, once we hit partner, we'll, I will, uh, I will start, I will commission some artists to get some new emotes going. Including, I suppose, a nice, very thick paw. Because that definitely sounds nice. So let's help me get there, and we'll uh, make it happen. You know, this this dead end always make this makes me very suspicious. I wonder if there's anything up there. Can I turn the fish into a platform? Let's see. I thought it said if you hold up when it happens or something that you can turn them into platforms. I don't know how it works though. It definitely said that I could turn enemies into platforms, but I have to like oh no, I have to hold down the button, don't I? I think I understand now. That's how you do it. Okay. I understand. <laughs> also, this this trip was incredibly pointless. Turns out there's nothing actually down here. So I think I picked up all. Uh, yeah, I got that treasure. So. Yep. All right, to Atlantis, I suppose. Ow. Damn it, fish. <laughs> what other mod do you have? Uh, well... Uh, another Maw Shot, definitely. I, I, I was gonna- I was playing, like, a, a, shadow, a, a slurp, so my muzzle with a big drooly tongue out, basically. Like, basically slurping the viewer, or slurping the person using the emote. Can't avoid me, spider. Don't delay the inevitable. Um, it's not entirely pointless. Let's gotta get another herb here. Herb, herb, it's herb. It's like that, but with more focus on just the tongue, the drool, you know, all that. I bought out his shop. Okay, good. Just a double checking. See, how do I get to Atlantis again? It's not this way. What am I doing? Um, Twitch, you certainly do talk about him a lot, but I suppose if nobody's annoyed, it's fine. Did I have to go underwater again? Oh, you're in the wall again. Good, good, good for you. That guy always goes in the wall. He has a slight, he has a slight like, placement issue. Uh, 
I don't actually remember where I... I, like, stumbled into Atlantis really easily that one time, and now I don't remember where it is. Where was it? It was this way, right? I think it was this way. Well, this leads to the castle, so this works. I have I have a memory like a goldfish sometimes. Well, I'm glad to hear that, Twitch. Yeah, I've got other emote ideas. Drooling, Shadok's tongue, focus. Not only a not only a slurping drooling tongue, but also a drooly mouth in the process. Just drooly drooly drool. Basically, I just named that a mode drool. <laughs> um, also, I would do... What else would I do? Well, I'd do the, obviously, a more paw-focused picture. Uh, mode. I would do... Probably a snoofer. Snoofer. Snoofer? Boofer snoot. Boofer snoot. It's a nice, just a nice big snow nose, one. I'd probably do one where the tum is being pressed towards the viewer, basically. You know, fat tum. Face squish? I could do that, maybe. You have to be very limited with the details you add to an emote, though. A hug? That's a good idea. Oh, I'm dead. Well, so much for that herb. Oh well. At least I at least I had the foresight to pick one up, right? All right, to Atlantis or Atlant, to Atlant. They forgot the is part. It's fine. Bad seashell thing. Clam. It's a clam. It's called a clam charm. So let's see. Atlant's that way. Abyss is that way. I got it. I can't get in, can I? Pronounce the following words to pass. I can't. But that is the monkey language, so thank you for that. Oh, what the fuck? Okay. Oh. I wasn't expecting that. Rock, I can't break. Got it. Hug. You want a butt hug? I don't know if I could fit butt hug. Oh, hello. Butt hug would be pretty good though if that could be an emote. I would be okay with this. I I can't talk to any of them. Oh well. I, I just can't do it. <laughs> Guess we'll move on. So I really start attacking with pearls of all things. Wow. Okay. The damage these things are doing, though. Now hard mode's starting to feel like hard mode, honestly. The damage is not insignificant now. Yeah, actually, that would be great. I wonder if I could. I wonder if there is some way I could make a butt butt hug emote without it being just a pixely mess because that's too much detail. Oh god, okay. These clams are durable too, it's hard to kill them before they attack again. Just keep talk you just keep talking about well I'm I'm into the idea now. Okay, how do you how do these guys attack? Do they attack? I mean, they, they move wildly. Okay. There. 
Thank you. <laughs> oh boy. Oh my goodness. Alright. Timer. I'm gonna keep playing a bit more though. Need a stronger sword. Too bad I couldn't buy them because I can't speak the language. Sign is face toward the water. Nothing is written on it. Okay. What's the other side of this area? The Lulu Town is up. Ow. Why? Oh, okay, I see. Well, there seems to be movable. Ah, shortcut. Still can't get that treasure, though. What about down here? Strangely, it's just, I guess it's just there for my own visibility. Towns to the left, to the right. What's over this way? Why can't I not? Oh god! There we go. We're good. Now we're better. Now we're better than good. Sweet. You want me to do a howl? Wow! Wow! There. Have a howl. <laughs> oh god! It's over here. worth doing. Now, obviously that would give me that. I didn't, I didn't think. Whoops. <laughs> now to go back through this and hopefully not... Well, I got a herb, so it's fine. God. Oh god, no! <laughs> Holy shit, I've jumped right into that shit. Alright. Just just to soften it up, because I'm scared of it. Oh my god, if I hadn't done that, I would have died right there. Oh god! Okay. These pearls hit like a fucking truck, man. These are- these pearls will- these pills are aimed to kill you. Oh, thank you, D DJ Nightfire. Thank you for the follow. Man, I'm I'm happy. Follows happen every single time I stream now, and I really appreciate it. One, two, three. You're done, right? Oh, I shouldn't do that. It's very dangerous. No, all the money. Oh well, not getting that. Cause I slipped. Oh, well, not getting that either. There's too much cuteness here. I am okay with this. Thank you. Cuteness is good. I don't trust you. Please die. You too. You too. Oh, God. Okay. Hmm. Something occurs to me. But to check this, I'll need to be very careful. Unfortunately, I don't really want to reset the enemies, but I need to check something. If I... If I did that really fast... Sorry, I have to try something. This might get me killed, though. Well, I have herbs, so it's fine. You see that platform to the left? I think I can get to it. I have a jump that I can use. All right, come on now. Yeah. Oh, it goes back here. Never mind then. <laughs> I thought it would lead somewhere useful. 
Right, let's do the clams again then, I suppose. I have no idea. I guess I'll just jump past of these ones. Of course you have new follows every time you're an amazing streamer after all. Aw, thank you, Engulf. Hopefully I don't die in a minute, because that would make me less amazing. Okay, cool. Games have a little bit of pity on me and give me some hearts. Also, next save point I get, I'm going to switch games at that save point to let you guys know. You are just naturally amazing. I don't... I mean, I guess so. I was about to say I don't try to be, but then again, if, it's, if I'm naturally amazing, then I guess that's the proof that I don't try to be. I just... I just... I don't know. I just want to be me. That's all I want to be. If being me makes me interesting, then great. Oh, it's tricked. I have to do this whole jumping puzzle again. How rude. So I guess I can't understand the lanterns right now, so I'm not going to the water temple right now. I have to go later. seem to be mean. Okay, honestly, the way this guy was drawn, he kind of slightly reminds me of uh, that one artist that did the Dragon Balls and Dragon Ball Z artwork. That, you know, he's famous. Every time he draws, like, dinosaurs and stuff, they always kind of look a little bit like this. Am I dreaming? A human! Wretched creatures, you are nailed to the ground. Very well, I challenge you. In this direction is my nest. If you can reach my nest without touching the ground, I will give you a reward. You accept my challenge? Uh, I'll try. What? Oh! 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 I didn't understand the challenge. I get it now. Oh, that was a good time for level up. I was like, oh, my health is really low right now. Toriyama, yeah. Thanks. Let's try that again. Okay. I accept. I'm gonna do it. This time I can do it. I understand how you do it. Okay. Wait. How am I supposed to ach No, I can't- I thought I was gonna- I thought I had to, like, sword bounce on things, but there's not enough enemies for that. So never mind, I'll do it later. I probably need some glider or something. Babel Tower. Babel Tower? Okay, Palulu Town. What's this? Book of Ancients. Oh, that's cheap. I'll buy that. No. <laughs> that's way too expensive. What the hell? I'm assuming that's a mana potion. Actually, I should check, just to make sure. I'm liking this game. This is a Gelos. Elixir. The 20,000 gems. Why is everything ridiculously expensive? How about you? Is this, how much is this? Samurai. See, that's affordable. I can do that. Give me your samurai armor. Shut up, cars outside. We don't need your opinion. Oh, it's a bunny! Hi, bunny guy. I'm trying to explain them that Babel Tower is a gigantic sleeping tower. Babel Tower is less impressive than what the rumors say. Sounds pretty impressive. Funny guy. I guess that was my save point. I guess I have to stop playing now. So, you can basically tell that I'm going to say that a Howler for an Hour game is probably worth it when I... when I get a little sad that I have to stop. So I do have to stop, though. So we'll, we'll come back to this, though, because I, I... This is definitely on... This is definitely getting put on the list of games I return to for Howler... from Howler games. <laughs> uh, yeah. Agelos. Uh... Very... Solid game. Uh, this is fifteen dollars on Steam, which is a little bit high for uh, more pixel-based games. I've, I generally notice, but this is I yeah, this one's worth it. This one's totally worth it. Excellent work. Good game. <laughs>